Hello everyone, we just a Fuji here back with another deck here. Today we're going to stack it as the bicycle Harry Houdini deck, which is some collectible playing cards. Uh, this one actually they put on Indiegogo, like some of their other decks as opposed to Kickstarter. But it's also available for pre-order on the website, which ended up being a better, more affordable option because shipping on Indiegogo was ridiculous. Anyway, obviously it's kind of a tribute to Harry Houdini, the man, the myth, the legend. And it features six gaffes and two reveals related to his magic. The front says Bicycle Harry Houdini. Playing card, it's got a perfect look to it. Look at that, there's a reveal right there, it's a jack of hearts. Yes, yeah, so it's a playing card jumping on the one side, like there's some finish on the other. Not much on top. Add dunk in the bottom, designed by. I'm not sure. Then, do I have the information? I don't. Could be Johnny Wham, could be somebody else. Probably Johnny Wham. There's a back, it's Harry Houdini. And his famous change in headlocks. This is like the third Harry Houdini deck, I think, that I have. Maybe more. Um, there's a stamp seal, with a padlock on it. Standard tuck case, aside from the weathering. Trade my stuff on the flap. Go to the cards. You get, once of gas, you get this 13 of spades. On the other side, it's this gaff where you're peeling back the back design, I guess, and revealing his image. A younger person handle looks like. I don't know much about that gaff, but there it is. Then there's this one, which is the same art as the box, except it says King of Cards. This is actually, there's a different deck called King of Cards from them, which is a stripper deck, which I did not get. Same thing, just as a stripper. But it's to change the color of the box, basically. And then there's this on the Joker's, which is his uh, famous escaping... His, his famous escape, he's all chained up here on this Joker. With red, and then now he's free. The only minor issue I have this is that Joker... He is in black and red, so it kind of hurts the illusion a little bit, in my opinion. As you can see, it's a different card. <laughs> Here's the spades. says Harry Houdini. Nice vintage style pip. Lots of weathering. Nice vintage style pips. And the court cards are fairly standard, but weathered. Nice custom aces throughout. Trying to see, thought there was maybe something else in the back of the tokers here. It's not, but it's a nice enough deck. Six different gas cards, it says. I count four. Unless there's something on my court cards that I've conveniently missed. <laughs> or the ace of spades. See if I missed any kind of reveals. Anywhere. Not that I've seen. And then in terms of other reveals, is there anything on the tuck case? I want to know that. Go on the jokers. I, I don't recall what the other reveal would be aside from the one on the tuck case that we saw. But yeah. Apparently just some reveals. <laughs> it's a classic stock. I've got some finish to this and cuts. It's good quality. Pretty nice gaffs and everything. Very fitting. I don't like it. I don't remember too much the other Houdini decks I had, so I don't recall where I would can't really say where I would write this one. But it's pretty nice. I'll give it I'll give it an A. Comment, like, subscribe, let me know what you think. We'll see you next time for Thanks for watching.